Module 22. Radio. In the previous topic, you sent data over wires, but the microbit also has a radio transmitter and receiver, so you can send and receive data wirelessly. To send or receive data wirelessly, you need to first import the radio library using this command. You also need to turn the radio on using radio.on. When you've finished with the radio, you need to run it off using radio.off. Otherwise, it takes up space in memory and keeps on detecting signals. You can send or receive a specific message. So if you wanted to send the word hello, you would use the code radio.send, open brackets and put hello in speech marks. At the moment, this will only send once. So if the receiver is not detecting at that moment, then it will never receive the message. To send it more than once, you will need it to loop. This program will loop forever. To receive, you need to use the command radio.receive. This will output whatever signal has been received or none if there is no signal. This value needs to be stored somewhere. So here it's stored in the variable new underscore message. This command will only run once at the moment. So if the message is not transmitted at that exact moment, then it will not receive it. So you need to loop until it receives the message. You can now do what you need to do with this value. In this example, it's received a string. So it is converted to a string from a radio message and outputs it.